Hi girls, welcome to Kyo Yun. Today I will introduce the function of shop authorization to you. So first, click shop authorization and uh, click Shopee. Sometimes the internet is slowly, so just wait a moment. Here we can see there are many shop sites to select. So the first one is Singapore and the second Malaysia, Vietnam, Shopee. Shopee sometimes shows Shopee also and the Philippines and Thailand and Indonesia and next Brazil and Mexico and Colombia and Chile then we input the name and password. Then we click login. Then we click confirm authorization. When successful, it will auto jump back to the current page. Then we can see the authorization is successful. Then we can see here are some functions. The first one, reauthorize the shop. Mm, this one is to, uh, if the shop authorization period is about to expire or has already expired, click on this and the authorization period will be updated on uh, usually for one year. The second one is delayed store. Mm, if you don't need to authorize the store to Keyo Yun, you can click this and uh, to end the authorization. The third one is synchronized store information. Uh, if the picture or name of the shop has been changed. So you can click this to use it. Then the fourth, fourth one is go to synchronize the products. So this function can synchronize all the uh, products of Shopee to Keyo Yun. Then the next one is go to synchronize orders. So this function is also can synchronize all orders of Shopee to Keyo Yun. The last one is authorize Shopee chat. This function, uh, if the seller needs to use the small screen of Keyo Yun to chat and uh, reply messages, you could uh, scan, you can scan the code, then you can uh, use this function. Here we also can see a SIP logo. If the sh shop is not authorized uh, when SIP is opened, click reauthorize to display this logo when SIP is opened midway. You can also see the sub uh, sub shops below okay that's all for today thanks for listening if you like our video please give us your likes or follow us have a nice day